Science fairs are a great outlet for students' creativity. They encourage students to stretch their intellectual capabilities, and they are fun. Now we'll meet Jackie Birnbaum, a high school freshman who participated in the Fairfax County Regional Science Fair. She's setting up her project right now. She's been working hard for months to get to this point, and now we will unfold her fate. Hi, I'm Jackie Birnbaum, and I go to Falls Church High School in Fairfax, Virginia. And this is my science fair project, and it's about the energy efficiency of different floorings. And pretty much what I did is I made six identical rooms, and I took five different types of flooring, and I wanted to see which one would heat up the fastest and which one would stay hot the longest. I turned these lights on. I measured the temperature every five minutes. And then after half an hour, I turned off the lights. And then I measured the temperature for 45 minutes every five minutes to see how fast it cooled down. I always wondered why my family room was always so much colder than the rest of my house. So my mom helped me come up with this idea to just to figure it out because I'm always cold. While the students prepare to be interrogated, the judges are going over the abstracts for each of the projects they will judge. After looking at the projects that they are assigned to, the judges reconvene to rank the students on the rigor and understanding of their work. The students are given first prize, second prize, or honorable mention. The very best projects are nominated for the grand prize competition. Andy, what are your criteria for judging the projects of the science fair? Oh, well, there are a couple of, two or three things I'm looking for. Um, first of all, I'd like to see a project that has some applicability. The scientific method is fun, and to make sure that they've proposed a problem, to make sure that they've got an experiment design. What about the statistical aspects? Well, the statistical aspect is definitely important. Let's see what our judge thought of Jackie's project. I like it because it's uh, got a lot of application in um, the real world. She's got a real good experiment designed to be able to actually measure the differences in temperature. I'd like to see maybe the average calculated of the different runs or some sort of measure of the variance between the runs would be real nice. And maybe some sort of discussion of the error that might be introduced perhaps by using the thermometers. It would be interesting to know whether color has any impact on the results. But all in all, it is an outstanding experiment. The scientific method is something that was followed here. Now that the judging is done, let's see how Jackie is doing. What did you think of all the judging? Oh, man, I got like 30 judges that came up to me. I got a bunch of organizational judges, which is really cool because um, it was like people that were actually like with energy efficiency. What about the uh, individual judges? The individual judges was a little more stressful than the organizational judges, but it was, uh, they asked pretty much the same questions. I didn't get like stuck with any questions, which is good. I was afraid they were going to ask like a stumper, you know? Yeah, well that's good. Uh, what was the toughest question you got? Um, well one of them asked me about like conductivity and like conductors. What did you think about the competition around you? There were so many good projects. Tomorrow we'll get to find out how the students placed in the science fair. In addition to placing in the science fair, organizations come around to award books, scholarships, even services to obtain a patent for a student's invention. But then again, they could win nothing. The winner of the Virginia Dominion $500 scholarship is Jackie Birnbaum. Let's find out how Jackie and some of her new friends did in the competition. That's awesome. Um, I got second place too, and I got um, $500 scholarship too. Yeah, I got first place. Awesome. This year's science fair was a great experience for all students. They had a good time meeting other students and went through a challenging learning experience that will help them in their future endeavors. Recording now? Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Hi. Uh, go on through. Hey guys. Why 
what? No. She's just making a video. Do you 